Hey y'all. My baby say it's morning. Um, it is morning. A lot of people don't want to say good morning because they say it sounds bad. So good morning. Um I guess I think they say like grand rising or something like that, but it's a good morning for me. Okay, it's a great morning for me. Um, today is the second day uh, that baby girl has left her mother, left the nest to go to preschool. Um, hold on, let me put something on my lip. Okay, y'all, I'm back. Is that better? I think so. Anyway, like I was saying, today's day number two of baby girl being in school and child, I don't know what to do with myself like um you know you when you when you're planning this all out and you're getting her started and everything it's like I'm gonna do this 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 and that um but baby pretty much like yesterday her first day I got a lot done. I, I have to say, I had, I had, I, I accomplished quite a bit yesterday, um, with her being out, with her being gone. I have on my calendar in the kitchen the days uh, that when she starts, I'm gonna be doing certain activities around the house, doing certain DIY projects and stuff like that that I don't really want her around while I'm doing them. That plan went out the window. Okay. Um, and I was just coming back in from running some errands after I dropped her off. And I was thinking that to myself. I'm like, I was supposed to be doing this. And I was supposed to did done this yesterday. I was supposed to have done this yesterday. But I didn't get it done. Yesterday was kind of like just a makeup day. Like it was the first day of her being in school. Uh, there were some things that I wanted to put in place. Matter of fact, today I should have went back and did a follow-up. Well, it's not even. I probably still do it um, before I go pick her up. But, yeah, like, I'm thinking I'm going to get around this house. I'm going to get these projects done. Because, one, this is coming down. This This thing back here. You know, you see it in my videos a lot, I know. But, baby, I'm so tired. I need that space for something. I don't know exactly what yet, but I need that space for something. So, that's definitely coming down. And we have, a, like, a smaller one here to replace it so she can still get her exercise in here at the house. Um, but that's got to go. That's an eyesore for me. In the beginning, when we first put it up, I was excited for her. Um, but it's been there for about almost a year. And it's got to go. It has got to go. They've gotten their use out of it, the little ones. They've definitely gotten their use out of it. And so, yes, yeah, it's got to go. Um, we were thinking about putting it outside for the kids in the neighborhood maybe um in the backyard or somewhere but i don't know i don't know what i want to do with it but i'm just i'm just rambling basically <clears throat> so yesterday I, I ran some errands i gotta get back focused there's so many things i need to do so um yesterday i ran some errands what was most priority on the list yesterday and then today i had some pl other plans besides the diy projects that i was going to do today those didn't get done um actually getting they're getting pushed back to tomorrow um because today you know the times it's just the times don't line up with some things you know some things are available on certain days and some things are just not so um it works better for me what i was going to do today to do it tomorrow 
So that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, today I didn't really do anything, um, except run to the grocery store. That was something that was on my list for yesterday, but I had so many other things on my list for yesterday. I didn't get around to it. And you all have to know, this is the first week. This is the first week, her first week of school, but this is also the hottest week all summer. Let's just say that here in this area. This is the hottest week. It's like, it's almost like summertime is like, I'm about to show up and I'm really about to show out before I leave. I'm finna let y'all know. I'm I'm finna, you, you, you F'd around and you finding out right now what summer is really about. That is basically what, we, what we're dealing with right now, okay? So, it's like, as soon as you walk out your door, you're drenched, basically, in a nutshell. That's that's what's going on here. And so, I do what I can. I do what I can without dehydrating myself. Like, yesterday, I was out, ripping and running, in that heat. And by the time I got back here, I still was feeling okay, but... Baby, when I say, when I say, see that background right there is a lot better than that. You see what I'm saying? Like, who can be serious with it in the background? Who? Yeah, yeah. Let's let's do this. Okay, so when I say I got back here after all the errands that I ran yesterday, because even after I picked her up, I had some things, uh, some meetings that I had to partake of in that was that was rough because we leave a meeting one meeting and we go outside she's like mommy it's so hot but she's so positive my baby is so positive she's like mama it's okay i look i like hot you know but you know how you get in the car and baby it is steaming like i'm like i'm trying to get the air on da, 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 da. she's like mommy it's okay i like hot i'm like oh that's my baby she's so sweet you know but baby, it, it was hot. It was hot. So we had to get it together. But we made it, honey. Me and her made it. We made it back here. She wanted to come straight home after school, actually. Um, she was tired. But she didn't want to tell me she was tired. And that's something that I like too, because she is tired when she gets out of school. And usually when she's home with me, she's everywhere, all over the place. No nap, no nothing. But I didn't have a problem. Yesterday, I told her, take her clothes off, go, you know, um, change it to some house clothes, because that's what we do around here. We don't wear outside clothes. Like, right now, I'm sitting on my couch, and I shouldn't even have on what I had on outside. But this is really how it is. Like, usually, um, we don't, we don't, like, I don't like sitting on my furniture with outside clothes on. Um, and then when I have company over and they sit on my couches, when they leave, I disinfect. It's not them. It has nothing to do with them. It's just how I like my home to be, if that makes sense. So, but yeah, um, I told her yesterday, go take your nap. And it was no fuss. It was no fuss. She... Went on upstairs to take her nap, honey. She got her little drink, and she said, okay, and she went on upstairs and got in that bed, okay? Um, last night was a whole different story, though, but she ended up going to sleep. But it's it's just things are different, and I, and I love them. I love how it is, like, even my older girls, like, Last night, cause we, I ended up going to take a nap with her. That's that was the point that I was trying to make. I ended up going to take a nap with her because I was tired. Like I had been outside all day ripping and running, and it was hot. So I went and took a nap with her, and we got up about seven o'clock. We laid down about four four thirty, and we got up at like seven o'clock. And I got her in the bath and got her some dinner. And 
It's time for bed again. She's back in the bed by 8.30. So, well, she was. She was back in the bed by 8.30. So, yeah, she was like, Mom, I got to see my teacher. I got to go to school tomorrow. So, yeah, she's excited about it. And I honestly, I really hope that she stays that way. I really hope that she stays excited about school. Like, my kids, you know, my other two, they were excited about school. Um, for the most part, they were excited about school. But, um, somewhere along the lines, they kind of just were over it. Um, and I kind of think that was because we moved out. We moved away from um, this other area we were in. So we 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 were in in different um, a different school districts, and they weren't too crazy about it. But you know, they both made it. They made it through, and um, they're moving on and doing you know decent. You know, nobody has nobody has um, signed up for college or nothing yet, but that's okay. Everybody is not made for college. Everybody is not made for it. They're not meant for it. And instead of you going and running it up, you know, with all these loans and stuff, if you're not ready, then, you know, don't worry about it. Especially if you didn't prepare, if you didn't make preparations before you left school to try to acquire um, free money, it's like mm -mm, don't even worry about it. Don't waste, don't don't mess your don't mess your life up now if you're not sure. So that is what I'm basically you know letting them know. Like don't don't try to pursue it if you if you don't want to go through with it. Don't do it be for me. Do it for you. You have to live with that life decision, you know. Um, so yeah. It's great. I'm sitting here, I'm talking to y'all. I have eggs, orange juice, butter. What else did I get? Eggs, orange juice, butter, beef, sour cream. I I think we have some potatoes here. I want steak and potatoes for dinner and some type of vegetable. But, um, so I, that's what the sour cream is for. Because I want some baked potatoes. But, um, I got myself sitting out over there. Because I was going to tell y'all about that too. But I just sat down because my baby is on my mind. She's gone. She's, she's at school and... I'm just, I'm getting stuff done. So, let me go ahead and put this, these groceries away and um, get to my next assignment. I'll see you in the next one.